Hey guys, how are you? This is your teacher Fred. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we will talk about agriculture, particularly in developing a plan for expansion of planting trees and seedling production. However, if you are new to our channel, can you please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell for you to keep updated to all of our videos and future lessons. Don't forget to like and share as well. Okay, let's go ahead and discuss on how we can develop and plan for expansion of planting trees and seedling production to improve the environment and increase the value of property. Planning for tree planting is very important. Whether you wish to plant a few trees or a large area, planning ahead can make the difference between success and failure. An agricultural country like Philippines is an ideal place for agricultural or farming business. Starting a farm or a fruit-bearing orchard it's good if you want to get involved in farming, especially in your own locality. According to Land Owner Resources and the Ontario Ministry of Natural Resources, the planting plan should include the following. A description of your objectives. You have to set your goals and describe what kind of plants or seeds do you want to plant? A map of property and a site description. You have to sketch your location to accurately know the estimate number of plants that you will plant. A detailed plans for site preparation. You have to learn the situation or condition of the location where you want to plant. The number of trees required by species. You have to identify how many seeds of plants that you will plant. Planting arrangement and tree spacing. You have to know where you will plant and separate those plants from other trees or from other plants that will grow taller. Plants to control unwanted vegetables. You need to have a plan to avoid unwanted plants to grow on your garden. Although agricultural business seems to be easy at the outside, there are tricks of the trade that you need to learn to succeed and few of these things are Getting rid of the plant pests Crop rotation Finding the right fertilizer And timing of planting and harvesting So, if you plan to buy an existing farm or orchard It would be best or good to find professional appraiser To help you investigate your investment if budget is a constraint, you can bring a friend who knows orchard or planting business or farming. It is also important for us to keep updated records of trees or seedling for sale. Because keeping a record of sales is one of the ways we can promote and market a product. For example, Keeping a record of sale for mango A. Sale of mango You have 54 kilos of mangoes multiplied by 25 and that will be the cost and it will be equals to 1350 and then you have to note of your expenses Labor 200, transportation 40, water containers 100, C 
seeds 75 insecticide 100 fertilizer 50 and a total of 565 now we need to calculate our profit we have to note the total sale and it will be minus by total expenses and the answer will be your profit so if we put it in a table it would look like this table for record of sales or expenditures they the items quantity expenses and profit great job we know now how to keep an updated record of our sale this time we'll talk about the use of online marketing but first what is online marketing online marketing is the component of marketing that utilizes internet and online based digital technologies such as desktop computers, mobile phones, and other digital media and platforms to promote products and services. So, the use of online marketing of orchard trees or seedlings is the fastest way to market products nowadays. Another is the preparation, distribution, and posting of flyers in conspicuous places to attract buyers, collectors, and those who are going to buy the orchard owners should provide the following artistically arranged plants, miniature, rock gardens, and healthy plants tall plants with thick foliage rare plants shady or clean and unobstructed pathways helpful information tips reasonable price cheerful honest and accommodating caretakers or salesperson here is an example of a flyer flyer And that is it for today my dear friends, thank you so much for your lesson. Alright, I hope you learned a lot today friends. I would like to say thank you as well for the continued support and for subscribing on our channel. Take note that planting trees are very important in our community. Okay friends. Thank you so much again for watching and please continue to support our channel. Please don't forget to hit subscribe and like and share. Goodbye for now my dear friends. See you again next time.